Welcome back. Time to take a look at the NNL talking about Nigeria National League. Some teams will be in action. Action returns today, Wednesday. You know, four is going to be promoted to the uh, Nigeria Professional Football League. They have it from A1, Rastas and Bimo Spartan. Uh, a lot of fixtures. Yeah, a lot, lot of fixtures to go through. Uh, unfortunately, we won't be able to go through uh, everything today. But you can see some really star matches there. Uh, Kyle, I can see Jiga Golden Stars taking Sokoto United. That looks like a big game now to uh, watch out for. Uh, if you go through the fixtures as well, too, you, know, you see action uh, between um, Aqua Starlet and Bielsa. Uh, Bielsa United, big, big sides uh, that are looking uh, to come into the Premier League. Gateway United will take on Bendel Assurance as well, so I imagine Cecilia is uh, very interested uh, in that one. While in Group B2, you're going to have action uh, between Delta Stars and Ikorodu United. Ikorodu United came the other time, went back straight. <laughs> I, I don't know, just quickly, uh, your thoughts uh, on this game uh, before we talk yeah, about Yeah, good to be back, so to say, for the NNL. And um, I'm looking at the Bendel Insurance Gateway United, oh, Ikorodu okay. United as well. Well, four of them will get promoted yeah. to join 20 teams yeah. for the abridged MPFL yeah. um, next season. Um, let's see how these teams fare. Over time, before mm. we separate the pretenders from the contenders. All right. Okay. Okay. That's okay. where they start. Time to look at the papers now. Right. Okay. Starting with our sporting life here. As we were starting with uh, this morning, are you curious? Uh, the one course go sing Lone <laughs> Star. Why are you laughing? Liberia I'm... won, Nigeria two. It was supposed to be international friendly. That's what we thought, but it ended up being exhibition game, celebration game, right? Car we're celebrate um, the heroics. So right. to say, of uh, George of Ongwe, okay. from our world, European and African football. Of Only the, ones uh, have done it. Only Africans. ones have done it. And eventually, he became the president of that country, having tried a number of times. I thought he wasn't going to play until we saw him training and everybody wanted to see him in action, and mm -hmm. that he did. But it was good for the fringe players of the Super Eagles because they showed him no respect. I saw how even John Ogu was. Trying to so, take him off. Okay, let's talk about this. It, it is quite topical, Ghana, because I've seen reactions and from a few people. I did not understand why a uh, 51 year old George Ware has come out of retirement briefly to play in an international friendly against uh, Nigeria. Does his appearance in that game in any way devalue uh, what was supposed to be an international friendly? He can pardon George Ware. He was once a footballer. Of course. And uh, I guess he just. Decided to join the team and say, okay, I want to play. Mm. He's it's the president the of the country the and they just gave him that leeway. Mm. Being a former footballer and seeing Nigeria as, in a way, big brothers in the region, he just wanted to strut his stuff and try to contribute his little quota. I didn't see... So it doesn't devalue the game For itself. me, it, it turned out to be an exhibition. But as our players did not water down or lower their own standard, I caught the game online. Okay. Uh, with the way um, the likes of um, Jamilu Collins and John Ogu played out the game, it was quite competitive. Mm. It was an opportunity for the French players to also try to impress the coach. Okay. The likes of um, Shemi Logo Ajayi and even Ernie Oyekuru and um, Simi Wankwa who got goals. Correct. They're trying to put themselves in the mix for the next qualifiers against Libya back to back mm. because they know they've got competitions in other established players mm. in the team. Well, okay. Also right. play against the legend as well. Well, yeah, exactly. Extra, extra okay, all right. Wins. Our complete sport is next. Amandu Bello Stadium may host uh, Super Eagles versus Libya. If it's still under construction, okay. maybe rehabilitation, refurbishment or what have you, why do we want to make use of the stadium? Perhaps it will be ready before October. Uh, why do we like the 11th hour first? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Last paper for review, Sports in Sun. Yeah, uh, okay, yeah, GG coming. I think we've gone past that one. Everton star uh, Ademola Lukman uh, to dump England for Nigeria. This has been rumbling for a while now. Well, it looks like uh, uh, his mind is made up. Ademola Lukman, what kind of quality does it bring him to the setup? Once well, I saw him on loan in um, Germany okay. last season like? and he did quite well. Okay. And uh, if he had decided to dump the three Lions for Nigeria, good one because some of these players, they get to struggle mm. while trying to represent England and they would have done better with the Super Eagles of Nigeria. So if he's coming the way of Nigeria, I think it's a good one for the young man. Mm. Good addition. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's right. going to be. Thank you. Thank you for coming. Always a show. pleasure to Appreciate be here. Appreciate it. Okay. Awesome. Well, full time. Back. Yeah. Thank you for watching. I'm Cecilia. Enjoy the rest of your day. I'm Taya Salam.